Hi, my name is Erin. I'm one of the molecular biologists here at ACGT. Today we are going to discuss how to prepare your samples in order to get optimal sequencing results. DNA quality is the most important factor in the sequencing process. You can prepare your samples with any kit, however we would recommend the kit from Kyogen. During the final step of the purification process, we require that the samples be eluted in nuclease-free water instead of the elution buffer provided with the kit. This is because the salt in the elution buffer competes with the DNA during the electrophoresis process, leading to suboptimal results. Before submitting the samples, please check the quality of them using a spectrophotometer. In addition to the concentration, the 260-230 ratio is a good indicator of DNA quality. The ratio should be right around 2. If the ratio is much lower, then this means the samples have salt contamination, and this will lead to noisy data. We therefore recommend to re-purify the samples before submission. We are ready to prepare our samples to be shipped. In order to prepare your samples, please use a sturdy microcentrifuge tube, preferably a transparent one. Grab a post-it or any small piece of paper and write the order number on that post-it note. Make sure the sample names on your tubes match the template names you've written on the order form. Take a small piece of parafilm and wrap it around the top of each of the tubes. Place the post-it along with your samples in one of the sample submission bags. Now that we know that we have quality DNA based off our gel picture and nanodrop, we'll go through the process of sample submission. For standard service orders, simply fill in the nanodrop reading for the sample into the order form. If you're using our LCO service, please dilute the samples down to 20 nanograms per microliter. In order to do this, take your nanodrop reading and divide it by 20. This will give you your dilution factor. Please then submit 10 microliters of this diluted sample for sequencing.